Okay, let me get situated in here, guys, and uh, tell you what's going to go on happen today. Um, I actually going to go to um, the uh, what was it? The park that actually just came out today it was the first bike ride vlog 235. I'm going to be headed to the the uh, the same um, park where you saw that at, and. Uh, do a vlog, uh, a vlog as well as a um, live at 11 a.m. Central Standard Time. So if you're seeing this, uh, check out the live that I did there. Um, but we're about to go on a trip tomorrow. Um, I got my package. Uh, somebody ordered two shirts, uh, two masks, and five stickers. Uh, I know you saw me pick this up. This right here is actually my earpiece. You only see one of them in my ear usually because by law, uh, they only allow you to use one while you're using your cell phone, like talking on it. But if you're using your, your, your media, like listen to YouTube or music, you can put both of them in and listen to, and both of them work. Uh, but this battery pack actually lasts, you can charge this up and this holds a charge to hold, to charge these both up four times so you don't have to keep charging them up every single time. You can put them back in the case and it charges up. You hit the button to show. There's the lights, the four lights. That means it's fully charged. Um, but um, it is a really great deal. If you want to check this out, go to my website at www.thegarbagedisposalstore.com. If you look under Amazon recommendations, this should be under electronics, I believe. But I have uh, recommendations that I buy. I'm not getting paid to tell you guys about this at all. Uh, but uh, stuff that I recommend, I think it's a good deal. You know, I'm cheap, but for the money, for the price, and for how how the quality of the stuff works, um, I put my recommendations there. Uh, I'll go over some of this outside of the other stuff that I got and what I brought. But uh, I brought my coffee. I need to get my first sip of coffee in because I've been doing all this without the coffee. So let me get this in and. I might run to a fast food place real quick to get some, a uh, little bit of, uh, of power inside of me. That's what she said. Um, and uh, to get this bike ride, get some fuel for this fire.
Well, I try to fit it into here, guys, but it's just too big. It only goes to there, so I had to put the uh, put the uh, package in the uh, the bigger slot. So let me get something to eat here, hopefully, and uh, get to going. Maybe I'll do a. Um, I'll have I'll have what they're having in front of me and do one and a half minute per person so if there's two people in the car it gives me three minutes to eat whatever they eat if they get like a hot coffee or something uh i'll probably get something colder so i don't have to down a freaking hot coffee uh, okay let's get there and get this bike ride going Okay, uh, I am here. Maybe I can get the police officer to, to watch me. I'll go over there and see if he'll time me doing it. I'm not sure if he will, but hey, it's something different for a video. I'm always up for something different. So uh, let me get uh, to ordering what they're having in front of me. And there's two people in the vehicle in front of me. So it looks like I'm gonna be eating three minutes, uh, a meal for three minutes. So I'm not gonna do that in the drive-in. Um, they're busy right now, so I'm not gonna do it. We'll drive through, you know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about. Tut, tut, tut. Uh, but uh, when I get to the drive through window, I'm not gonna sit there and have them wait about one to three minutes, uh, depending on what they order here. Uh, so I will park. Maybe I'll ask the police officer, like I said, just to do something different. If I get shot down, I get, oh, it's not the word, right word to say. Okay, let's see what I do. I don't know. I'm playing it by ear too. Go to post-stop recording. Okay, I am next. Uh, th there's two people in the car ahead of me. If I did not tell you earlier what I do on the drive-thrus now or if I'll have what they're having, if I do that, I'm gonna give it one and a half minutes per person. So whatever they order, I have to eat in one and a half minutes. If it's one person, if it's two people, it's three minutes. So today, it's two people, so I'll see what they ordered. I um I was wondering it's gonna be kind of strange, but can I have whatever they had in front of me, like the whole order? That's my mom buddy. Okay. And just no ice on the sodas. That's fine. Okay. Just what? Whatever they ordered on both orders, because there's two people in the car. Do they order two things? No, they just had one order. Oh, okay. I'll just take all of that. And it, do they get a soda or anything? Uh, yeah, they got, they got a Sprite. Okay, I'll just take... They got two sides and two sides. Oh, okay, I'll take this, the Sprite. Uh, I'll take everything, but I want no no ice in the Sprite. Okay, boy, I'm please. Okay, thank you. Okay. Well, hopefully you guys like these drive through um, it's, it's something different for me to do. Um, instead of me picking in my own brain like hey i'm gonna do this challenge that I, i'm pretty much sure i know what my capacity kind of is and the time limits and stuff so i would do stuff like this at least it's a surprise there might be one person in the car and i give myself one and a half minutes and they're ordering for the whole freaking building there might be like 10 people or 20 people they're ordering for and i have to eat it all in a minute and a half and that's just part of the game so uh I'm going to go ahead and cut this off until I get to the, the window. Uh, it's going a little slow. Hello? Okay, so you got one spine, no ice, and two sides, That'll work, whatever they had. All right. Okay, I got a different camera angle here. I put my microphone on 
the visor. Um, I have this on the dash now. Um, it's going to be a little bit handicapped because when I was pulling that, I was in the back um, earlier this morning. I was pulling the strap to to to, to uh, secure the wheel to the bike rack in the back. I think I, I don't know what dislocated or what, but it is freaking freaking hurting, swollen a little bit. Um, but this one is a small hash brown, one small sprite, two two sandwiches. I think the two impossible. Somethings. Um, it says one ice. Oh, one minus ice. Okay. So I got one soda, one small soda, no ice, a hash brown, and uh, two biscuits, two breakfast sandwiches. Okay. Think I can do that in three minutes. I don't have my tray in here, and this is her vehicle. So hopefully I don't make a big mess in here. Um, if I if they don't do it at the window here, I think it's going to take me under. I'm going to say. A minute and a half okay for two sandwiches a soda and a hash brown so I'm gonna try to do it right here if, if they don't want to do it I understand and I will go to a uh, another place I was gonna ask just police officers there uh, but I think they are about to leave because they actually cut in line to, to get their food and um, they're probably gonna be leaving if they're on the other side of the building though and I don't do it here I will ask them Go post stop recording. Okay, they're pulling off. Let me hit this window and see how this goes. You know what? I'm going to opt out of doing this at the window because it is really busy. It's like four cars deep in back of me. And I think more is pulling up. So I'm going to do this in the parking lot. I'm going to be civil about it, kind of. You didn't even grab your strawberry jelly bag? Um, let me get a little bit of both. Well, no, you know what? Don't even worry about it. You sure? Uh, I'm good. I had a Sprite with mine, though. I had, like, whatever they had in front of me. With your order was just like that? Yeah, yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I saw the milk. I saw the orange juice. So like, I didn't get any orange juice. Oh. <laughs> she caught it right at the last minute. I started digging into the eyes like no eyes. I'm prefer. I'll do YouTube videos. Actually, I'm gonna eat all that food. I'm gonna try to eat all the food in less than three minutes. Okay. So I was gonna. Uh, I do a YouTube video. So if you want to check it out, I have this video out in about about a week and a half or so. Okay. Here you go, buddy. All right. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. All right. Thank you. You too. Okay, yeah, I saw her digging into the ice and then she caught herself and I was about to honk my horn, but I didn't have to honk. She looked at me and she saw that no ice because I don't want to do any ice while I'm trying to do a speed challenge. It's, it's not that speedy to have ice in there. Uh, so I'm going to pull around. It's not a pretty, it's not a big parking lot that I can really do. Hmm. So I can just back in here and do it. I'll do it over here. I'll do it over here, out the way. Okay. Well, I'm not, like I wasn't going to time myself there. Like I said, there's too many, uh, too many cars in line, and I'm not going to do that to everybody. But like, if I do like a minute challenge or something like that, I don't mind doing it at the window because some people did comment on my comments saying, "Hey, uh, why, why'd you do it in the window? I'll be mad if you're behind me. Get you know doing that in front of me because I'm trying to get my food." Like, the, the time that it takes usual people to do this, to look in a bag for ketchup and stuff, I'm already done eating. So, you don't do that in the drive through then, okay? How about that? All right, let me uh, situate these cameras real quick and... Mmm. 
Can you get a fry so it won't be too messy? I'll do it in here, okay? Oh, there's hash browns. It kind of got all over the place. Oh. I'll figure it out. Be right back. Go post stop recording. Okay, just got done with my Burger King um, drive through uh, video. Uh, so if you didn't watch that, please check that out. Uh, it might be out already, but I'm not really sure. It might not be out. I don't know if it is. Uh, check out the um, I'll have what they're having, Burger King, whatever. It'll be named something like that. Okay. Let me get going and get to this bike ride, guys. Um, it is sprinkled just a little bit, and I was a little a little scared, but I think it's just a little bit, excuse me, whew, a little bit of clouds here and there, excuse me, a little bit of clouds here and there. I don't think it's going to be too awfully bad, but I think uh, I'll be okay. I'm supposed to go live today too out there, so I might have to find a little shelter, a little pavilion if they have one out there to go live if it starts raining. So uh, let me get uh, going before, before my feet get to roots and I get too lazy not to even ride a bike today. So let's burn these calories off. Okay, parking over here at the riverfront. Um, we rode last time our bikes all the way down past there, um, and we're straight across from there. So we wasn't too far from the Bass Pro Shop, but it was getting it was getting too dark, so we didn't get to make it all the way to the Bass Pro Shop because we parked all the way down yonder. Um, I'm going to probably I'm not sure which direction I'm going to go. I think I might I might go that direction for a while and um, come back and I want to do a live maybe just right out here um, and have a nice uh, a view of the boats maybe. I'm not really sure. Um, I'll figure it out once I'm riding my bike and, I, and I'll stop and, and do a live wherever I, I feel that is the best spot. It's, it's not, uh, it's an overcast today. And I'm not really sure why even they call it an overcast. That's, you might want to let me know in comments, but uh, I'm gonna go get to riding and uh, wish it was sunnier, but Hey, I don't make the weather. So, talk to you guys in a little bit. Let me get this bike off. Okay, I'm out here at the riverfront getting this bike together. I don't know if you saw everything on this bike yet. I just added a couple new deal, new features on here um, to hold my GoPro. There's a clip on this GoPro that actually um, I used to slip in this right here because it's easier for me just to clamp this on and off and to take this and maybe you know just get a view of everything like that so i might keep this right here but just in case i have other cameras that i want to just keep rolling um i put one right here there's a pipe it's it's called a, a like a pipe clamp but it goes on right there so i can go ahead and this swivels as well i can click this button and swivel this whole deal around if i need to to do that uh but there's one right here i put one over here and uh so that is some of that stuff here's the other uh i have a light right here i have a light right here um i have a light back here this is the the rear light and the front light let me show you there you go uh, i have a bike lock i lost my key to this but i just found it but i got another lock a bike lock here um, so you don't need a key. So if you, you don't want to carry any keys at all, uh, that's a lock there for the numbers. Um, I have a pipe. Um, no, that's not a pipe. Cut, cut, cut. A pump uh, to air a tire up. And I have a, a fanny pack here for my bike. I'm going to get a bigger one that fits on top of here. It's coming in the mail. I can fit it on top of there. But I can carry more stuff in here. But I got my mirror. I put on my left side of the handlebar because that's where the car is going to be coming from. So I can see in the rear view. Hey. I would wave at you, but I only brought two hands today. Uh, I have an extra, extra inner tube in there. Um, I have uh, a key for the whole bike. 
Well, somewhere in there. Well, it's kind of hard to do this with one hand. But she said, here you go. Here's the key. And I'm not sure why, guys, I'm not sure why this has everything on it but a flathead screwdriver. This has every tool on this, like a Phillips, an Allen key, a star key, um, bigger Allen keys back here for the whole bike. It does not have a, a flathead screwdriver. I don't know what's up with that. I must got the cheap model. But that's the only thing it don't have on there that I need for the bike. So I could just have to use a little screwdriver or something of a, a flathead I put in there. Okay, well, let me get to riding um, before... Like I said, before it rains on me or whatever, and find a spot to go live. Talk to you in a little bit. Go post stop recording. Okay, I decided to stop here. As you saw the um, video that I did, I'm glad I did stop here. There's two bike riders that came by and was kind of talking what they thought this was. Um, and they said, hey, maybe somebody's uh, fell from the boat or somebody's jumping from the boat. Uh, they actually didn't even get anything of what this monument was even here for. And this is the main purpose of putting this in here for the park. Um, this is Tom Lee. Uh, this is one of the engineers 
uh, Engineer Club of Memphis, one of them. There's 55 people that had uh, that uh, that came off the boat. M. E. Norman uh, and Tom Lee was out there. He might have been fishing or something. They didn't say that, I believe. But he um, he can't even swim. But he saved 32 of the 55. So 23 people had died, but 55 probably would have died if he didn't save them. And he couldn't even swim. Uh, he went all through the night, and he he did uh, uh, he did. Uh, a rescue 32 of them uh, what this says here that's why this park is renamed they renamed the park the Tom Lee Park I believe so I think this is the Tom Lee Park I have to check when I get back to make sure uh, if that uh, if that uh, is correct uh, I'm not sure if if this part of the park the whole parks Tom Lee I'm pretty sure um, Tasha would know if she was here but I think this is the Tom Lee Park but I'm glad I stopped and saw this monument and read it uh, because this is why they put this here instead of you to speculate what it is like it's an art 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 and museum but uh okay well piece of history i do like history and there you go you're welcome okay let me get set up for this live i might set up this live right here this might be a good spot to set up for a live and i can talk about it as well on the live so uh see you in a little bit on the live if you check that freaking live out okay but after the live i'll get back to you guys and head back toward the uh the uh car to put the bike up and head back home to edit this video go post stop recording go post stop recording All right, had to go back all the way to the vehicle. I only have 20 minutes, so I have to drive my bike back to where I was for the uh, the Tom Lee m Monument. Uh, that's what this park's named after, so I was going live there. All I needed was this little cord, a TRS to TRRS, and then my little windshield mic for my uh, microphones. Uh, I have this GoPro wireless right here that I'm going to be... Uh, be using on my phone for the first time so hopefully that works good on the live and it sounds good so that's what i do guys to try to one up the uh, sound quality and stuff like that just uh that you, you guys usually don't see if i don't tell you uh or here you don't you don't talk about both but i'm gonna uh go back i got my backpack here and i, I brought extra stuff this time so if i miss something i'll have it in that bag so i won't have time to come back with the live so i gotta shut up now i gotta go back to the monument and i'll go live so see you there go post stop recording okay i'm back at the uh the drop zone uh, i'm about to go live but this is called the tom lee park i did notice that when i went live when i set up the live it asked me uh where did i want to uh uh pick a spot at tom lee park tom lee uh memorial uh tom lee park so there you have it go pro stop recording i got my one earpiece in from my phone but i finally got this one out uh, this is only time when i get this out is when i do the media the wind's kicking up so i'm about to put these in listen to some music
Okay, made it back. Uh, I'm gonna put this bike on here and head to the house, edit this video, and um, probably gonna go ahead and call it a day. My finger's hurting pretty bad from this uh, this little loop here earlier. I had uh, pulled this through here and then used my finger to pull down and finger went sideways and it's really, really hurting right now. So I guess I won't point fingers at people for a while. Other than that, uh, let me get this on here and uh, appreciate you watching this vlog. I really do. Uh, thank you. And again, if you didn't see that Burger King, I'll have what they're having uh, video. That is the, should be out. If it's not out, it'll be out in the next two or three days. And that's all. Thanks. Go post up recording. Hey, thanks for watching the video again. And if you could please subscribe if you haven't already and hit the notification bell to get notified of all the videos. Hit the like button. The more you like the videos, the more it gets shared over the internet. So that would really help me out. Um, I will uh, ask you to stay tuned. If you haven't visited my website yet, please visit my website. And uh, you can see frequently asked questions and merch and see how to order merch and everything like that. Okay, here is the website. If you haven't been here already, you just go to www.thegarbagedisposalstore.com. Um, here are the categories up top. Uh, here's a question and comment form. It goes straight to my email if you have any problems with it. The first one here is the merch. If you ever wanted to order merch from me, I made it a lot easier. Everything is on here. This is the limited edition shirt right here that I'm scrolling over. That is the gray. I only have a couple left in that one, but it'll all be on this site. Once they're they're out of this site, then I don't have them anymore. But uh, here are the hoodies. Um, I have the gray hoodies and jackets coming. Um, that's be December 2020. So anytime after that, I'll definitely have them in stock for you. Um, I am doing these, uh, the the uh, pre-order here probably uh, the end of October 2020. So you can pre-order those if you like have masks, uh, aprons, stickers, and then the black shirts. Uh, other than that, on this front page, I do have videos, like the first five recorded challenges I've ever done, throwback bad acting, uh, most delicious challenges, biggest challenges solo and as teams, um, bloopers, and magical food tricks. You have to click on it to see what that's about. Um, if you want to ever follow me on any of the links to Facebook, the YouTube, the Twitter, Instagram, it's all here. Um, this is my email right here. So if you ever wanted to know my email, you just click that button and you can email me. Um, all the, the Facebook, everything's right here. Um, I have articles of how I got started with professional eating. Um, this is the YouTube community news tab. You can go to the community news on YouTube and see what's going on over there. Events tab is the, uh, the calendar of trips and everything. You can get uh, whatever videos that's about to come out. You can see when they're about to be released. Frequently asked questions. I have a lot of frequently asked questions on there. I get asked frequently, so I put them on here so you can read. Um, Amazon items I recommend. I'm going to say car items. I'm going to click car items. If you see my speed challenges, you will definitely know what this is right here. This is my car tray that I use for the uh, food tray in the car. But I have all these I recommend. This is for my phone. Um, so I have all this. I have um, the, the videos, the GoPros, and everything in, in, different, in different categories here. But uh, if you scroll down to the bottom of this page, you can be... Um, in the in the now um, you know what's going on if you fill this out you get a newsletter once a week and then then you, you get up to five a month so I, I put four out once a week and then one extra one during the month there's something extra um, going on a sale or if I'm going on a trip but other than that just fill that out you'll get an email saying verify you just click verify and you're good to go you'll get all kind of goodies um, in your newsletter about what's going on and you'll know more than what most people do Probably no more than me. But other than that, guys, here is the um, cell phone. Again, I'm going to click the, the tablet. This, this is what it looks like on the tablet. Still about the same. But this is the phone where you have to click this little box in the right, and you'll see all that frequently asked questions and merch and everything. So if you have any other questions, um, please go to the top left corner of the home. You'll see the question and comment, and get with me. So I appreciate it very much and talk to you later.